Hey guys! Hello everyone! And welcome to another episode of Massey, Massey Art, Art Studios. Studios. I'm Jeremy. And I'm Lee. Yes, you are. I thought, yeah. That's right. In today's episode, we have some couple, we have a couple of things. We have some couple of we things. We have some couple of things. Uh -huh. <laughs> that is going to be very exciting for the channel today. At least on my part, because I know what I'm going to do. Like, I have this all figured out in my head. And... I know what I'd like to do today. Well, you're always excited for one. Yes. For two, you've picked all the colors for this episode. I did pick all the colors for this episode. So tell us what you're doing. Um, I'm going to be doing a 22 by 28 canvas, mm -hmm. and it's going to be a double ring pour wrecked. Wowzers. Yes. I love it. Some some painted boobies on a canvas that you're going to then wreck yes. and tilt it out. Yeah. I love it. I love it. What are you going to do? I'm going to channel... Our East Coast girlfriend, <laughs> call in the swiping goddess all the way from the East Coast, Kathleen, and yes. I'm going to swipe on a canvas. And Kathleen is from Cause Creations. If you That's haven't right. seen her, That's please right. go That's check right. her out. She's amazing. Of course you've seen Kathleen. I mean, who hasn't seen Kathleen? Well, just in case. But if you haven't, if do you check haven't, her out. Go check her out. Yeah, please do. Yes. Who is, have you got inspiration for your double rack ring? Oh my gosh. Um, <sighs> colors, actually, yes. Um, from Amina Villegas, yes. Our West Coast mistress. Our West Coast mistress. Right. <laughs> yes. Um, I, some of these colors I've seen her use before, and it's right. kind of what inspired me to, to, to try to put these together right. and use these. So. And the first person I think I saw use a chopstick to wreck was Sarah Mack. Yes. And actually, the chopstick that I'm using today is from Sarah Mack. She gave it to me at uh, Faye. Okay. The fluid art exciting yeah. times. Yeah, so all of our lovely ladies are represented in our pores today, but these are very much our own. Yeah. Absolutely. And I'm going to play around with the swiping kind of like uh, composition. That's the word I'm looking for <laughs> uh, on, on mine. It is not going to be the straight line that you guys have seen me do a few times. Awesome. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I'm excited. Awesome. Well, I tell you what, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It means the world to us and uh, helps out on this painting journey of ours. And I think that we should get to the table. I think we should. I'm excited. Let's do All it. All right. We'll see you there. Hey guys, it is Jeremy here, and I am super excited about today's pour. Why um, is that, show pony? Because I'm doing a huge 22 by 28 inch canvas, which has been already pre-flooded. Uh -huh. I'm so excited about this. It's obviously been taped and pinned on the back. And what kind of flood color is that? It was kind oh. of a custom color, right? Yeah, it was kind of a custom color. It okay. was this um, phalo blue uh -huh. and this pink that we had. And so it just kind of made this like really luscious royal blue. Yeah, it's definitely not phalo. It's definitely yeah. like that. There's a king's blue by Amsterdam. Yeah. That reminds me of yeah. it. Yeah. Love it. Totally. And um, so, yeah. So uh, today, the colors that I've chosen um, are very interesting, to say the least. But uh, we, of course, are using the 24 karat uh, Deco Art uh, Gold. Metallics. Metallics. Yeah, really interested. And if, if at this time today, when we are filming this, which is the weekend, you can buy this on their website. It is on sale for just over $7, $7.50 a pot. Wow. And it is on the decoart.com website. Wow, that's mm -hmm. great. You heard it here, folks. That's great. Um, we have Phalo Blue by Goldens. Okay. We have Quinacridone Nico Azo Gold by Goldens. Mm -hmm. We have this luscious sky blue topaz by Extreme Sheen. Another Deco Art Deco color. Art. Mm -hmm. We have Rich Espresso by Deco Art Metallics. Love it. Yes. Um, we have this Phalo Blue by Amsterdam. Okay. And Titanium White by Amsterdam. Because we've run out of Pearl. We did run out of Pearl. That day, that pearl is hard to find right per now. Pearl used to be a singer. Yeah. She's now an escape artist. And I can't find her anywhere. <laughs> so. Like, Pearl who? I was trying to figure out who you're Pearl talking about. Pearl the singer. It's a song. Uh, but yes, it's hard to find. Yeah. And what is. are you going to do aloft of this 22 by 28 inch canvas? I have two cups. Uh huh. Behold, two cups in front of you. Behold. Behold. So um, I'm going to do a double ring pour. Oh, lovely. Okay. And I'm going to wreck it. Excellent. Yes. All right. So why don't we get to layer in my cups? Why don't you layer one? Are you going to layer these both identically? Um. Probably not. Okay, then let's layer one on camera, one off camera. Okay, sounds good. Is that cool? Yeah. All right. Okay. 
So the center of my canvas, like I, I'm trying to figure out what I want to put the center in the of your center ring. of my ring. Yeah, that's going to be last out. So okay. um, what the center of my ring is going to be. So I'm really kind of being very cautious about this. Um, I think I might go with, start with the sky, to, sky blue topaz. Okay. I really like that. I think it's really pretty. Um, I think I might go with a little bit of gold. Just literally a touch because we all know gold can take over. Some of this delicious phalo blue. And then next I think I'm gonna go with the espresso. Okay. So this is a 22 by 28 inch canvas. When you multiply those two figures together and divide by 28, we've already calculated that there's 22 ounces of paint that you can put on this canvas at least. Yes. Now these are 16 ounce cups. So I would suggest you don't fill them all the way, but somewhere between three quarters and full would be ideal. And that'll give you something between 25 and 30 ounces of paint. Fantastic. I'm like really nervous about what to put next. Uh, I think I'm gonna go in with this phalo blue again. Mm, that was tricky. Did you wait? <sighs> Let's see here. So, pearl on pearl. I'm fine with that. I know you hate that. <laughs> hate is such a strong word. You dislike that very much. I do dislike it very much, but I know that you love it. That's the only reason why I say it. All right, sir, that is one full cup. That's one full cup. That is. So you're yeah. gonna do another one now. We'll just pull that one off camera. Yeah, sure. Let's get to it. Okay, guys, so I layered my first cup. I want to see how these colors are gonna come out onto this canvas. And then I'm gonna layer my second cup. Mm -hmm. um, Cause I'm really interested to see cause I, the way that I layered these colors. So let's get to making some rings. Okay, do it. Okay guys, so I poured this onto the canvas. It's a little heavy in some of the colors, um, like this gorgeous uh, phalo turquoise. Mm -hmm. And it's a little heavy in this uh, sky, light, uh, this light blue topaz, sky okay. light topaz. Um, so I'm gonna layer my cup differently on the next one and awesome. we're gonna see what happens. That's interesting. So you've but, got a little roadmap now to do your next yeah. one. Okay, let's do it. Okay guys, so I have my second cup layered here. I layer a little bit differently. So we're gonna see what happens whenever I pour this one. Do it, big boy. Yes.
Yeah, dog it. I was trying to catch that and I didn't get it right. Two lovely rings. <sighs> Two lovely, lovely rings, both completely like a little bit different with the same colors. I'm really loving this, you guys. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen whenever I wreck it and when I stretch this out. So let's get to wrecking it. And I see you're doing a loopy loopies. I am, I'm gonna be doing loopy loopies and some straight lines, I think. Ugh. So we'll see. Okay, can't wait for them. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. You went exceedingly fast all the way through that there. Yeah, I did. Yeah, that was interesting. I was enjoying myself. I see that. <laughs> <laughs> you were waving that thing like it were a wand. Yes. Okay, so now that I've wrecked my, my uh, rings, I'm gonna go ahead and get to stretching this out and That's we'll right, see what happens. Because your base coat is already on there, so you don't yeah. need a flow extender. Exactly. So is it actually officially now tilting time? It is tilting time. Let's tilt this one out. Wow, you guys, I cannot wait to take you in for a close-up of this. There's so much happening in this, and I'm in love with all of this. I'm in love with this. Um, it's really interesting because this looks like a person. 
Like this is the head, the shoulders, like the body, and then the little legs right here. Hmm. Hmm. That's what I see. Everyone's going to see it backwards. They might not. Yeah. Get to see it. <laughs> Maybe I'll flip it when you do one of your one of the dries. You know so, the, the wet results. I'm going to get my edges. I'm going to take you guys in for a close up. Um, we just torched it, so yeah. I can't wait to show you guys what all it's I see in this. Beautiful. It's very topographical. I like it a yeah, lot. I'm loving this. Nicely done. All right, guys. Alright ladles and jelly spoons, it's Lee here and I gotta say beautiful double wrecked Thank ring you. pour by the show pony, stunning, I absolutely loved it. Um, I'm gonna do a swipe yeah. on this 14 by 18 inch canvas. Um, I've got Jeremy's colours but I've kind of played around with them a little bit. First off, this is the Phalo Turquoise, but to this I've added some 24 karat gold, which gives me that really beautiful shimmery peacock colour, which Wonderful. I absolutely love. To the Nicolazzo Gold, I've added some 24 karat gold, and that's what's in this cup right here. Um, I've also got a little bit of the base coat saved just in case I needed it. And then for my swiping colour, my titanium white, I've added a little bit of 24 karat gold. So there's a bling in every single one of my colours today. Um, I also do have the espresso and the, the topaz. Is it topaz blue, do you say? The light yes. topaz blue? Yeah. Um, these are my deco art colours. So yeah, I'm blinging this one out from top to bottom, um, which I think is always good in a swipe. So that's what we're going to do. First, let me cover my canvas with my delicious phalo and 24 karat gold colour and then I'll come back to you and we'll just talk about the swipes. So let me get to that first. All right, so there's that delicious Phalo Turquoise by Golden's 24 karat gold mix, which you can never see this as beautiful as it is on camera, but it really is this wonderful peacocky kind of color. Next, I've got various sizes of paper towel, which I've cut up into various sizes, as I just said. And I've dampened <laughs> these, I've wet these ends because I'm gonna swipe with wet towels, I'm not gonna swipe with a color. So next I'm gonna layer my colors on the canvas, but I'm not gonna do a straight line. I'm gonna actually do kind of different You'll see. I'm going to do a fun composition oh, on this one. Wow. So we're going to get to playing around with this right now. So sit back, please. Listen to this squeaky glove and some funky music. And um, I'll be back and talk to you in a little bit.
Wow, it's like a melted chocolate caramel dream. Um, I really love this. Um, I didn't want to do just a straight boring composition, which I normally do. Not that it's boring, but it's just I've done it and I kind of really wanted to challenge myself to do something a little different. Um, loved that nickel azzle gold and you can kind of really see it coming through even under all the other colors. So I'm going to keep this one exactly as it is. I'm not going to add any base coat color to this at all. I think it's perfect the way it is. I hope you enjoy this. I hope you like to watch me do some little swiping. I'm going to get my edges. I'm going to torch it one last time. And I'm going to take you in for a close up. Awesome. Thank you guys. So there you have it. No, that's my catchphrase. <laughs> You're supposed to share everything. Well, I'm married, I guess. You can have it. Happy, happy so husband. So there you have it, folks. Well done. Yes, well done. Thank Very you. well done, yes. What, what did you think? Um, I absolutely am in love with mine. I thought it came out amazing. I did too. Yes. I'm seeing lots of like sky in it and lots of rainforest and mountains and I, I turned it actually vertical instead uh -huh. of horizontal and so I really loved what happened with that. I also saw a little oh. man in it. Oh. So I will show it to you the way that Jeremy's just talking about it right here. I thought it was stunning. I thought it was really pretty. Thank you. I know you love the pearl on the pearl yes. and that created that real cloudy effect up in one mm. side of it and then I loved all the kind of yeah. thick bold straight lines in the other. Yeah, really stunning. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. And what about yours? I loved it. I know that there was a point where the show pony was like confused at the side <laughs> as I was pouring this one out because he wasn't really sure what I was doing. But I had something in my mind and I, and I really hope it translates on the canvas this time around. It looked like molten caramel chocolates. It was so good. It reminded me of like little giraffes actually in a couple of oh, areas. What have yeah. you been smoking with these shadowy men and giraffes? Oh, Whatever. Um, whatever it is, you're not sharing it. Um, <laughs> so um, yeah, I really enjoyed it. It was really fun and I liked playing with the composition on this one for sure. Definitely yeah. gonna, you know, play around with swipes an awful lot more. Um, Kathleen is is the mistress of the swipe. She's the queen of the swipe and, and she does some beautiful, beautiful compositions beautiful. that I couldn't even dream of getting anywhere near. But this one I really enjoyed. Yeah, yeah. it was absolutely stunning. Well, thank I loved you. it. Thank you so much. Yeah. So, well, all right, you guys, we're gonna let you get back to your Tuesday night. Right. And uh, thank you for all for being here and for chatting, up, uh, chatting us up. And uh, we will see you on Friday. Uh huh, for another fun episode. Another fun episode. Yeah, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. We will see you then. Yes. All right. All right. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. See you soon. And now to spank the Patreons. Spank the Patreons? Yeah. Who are the Patreons? Yeah, well, let me tell you. <laughs> the Patreons are a really special group of people um, that have joined us on our Patreon account. Now, that is a very special account to our YouTube channel. Yeah. And over there, people can opt into certain tiers or certain levels. 
One level will give you sneak peeks and behind the scenes footage, lots of little secrets about what's going on in Massiar's studio. At another level, you'll get access and invited to a WhatsApp group where the show pony and I <laughs> chat, we share pictures, and then we set a weekly painting challenge. Yes. At a different level, you also get access to an exclusive once a month live stream that isn't aired on the YouTube channel. And at the Platinum level, you also get access to a once a month tutorial where we do like a real deep dive into a, a technique or yes. something that the guys, the Platinum Patreons, really want to know about. Now to spanking those people. At our gold level, we have Trisha West, Terry Leshner, Tammy Hasbrook, Stephanie Hancock, Sharon Luffy, Rebecca Hawes Winters, Patsy Petrelli, we have Nate Bright and Misty Tyson. We have Mama Doulas, Linda Serien. We've got Kelly Stowell, Janice Swansea. We've got Jane Klein. We've got Gloria Salaki, Gillian Kennedy, Donna Panis, Donna Patterson, and Amy Gardner, AKA, AKA Crafty Chicken Mom. Oh, that's a lot of spanking. It is a lot of spanking. Well, the spanking continues okay. with the platinum level. Right. Who is Susan Shepherson, Leslie Beaver, Janice and Steve Pittman, Elaine Burton, Dana Foxley, and at the diamond level... Hey, you all know her lover. <laughs> Sparkles. Sparkles. <laughs> Yay, I've got a sore hand from all that spanking. <laughs> so to you guys and everyone else down below at the bronze and silver level, thank you so very much for wanting to be with us, for the extra support, and uh, for wanting to take a little bit of extra interest in Massey Art Studios. Absolutely. Thank you, guys.